Sunny. <laughs> you uh, need some change, Grandma? Well, I, I'd rather have a cup of coffee. Sure. Here you go. Oh, no. I can't. They, they won't let me in. Maybe you could get it for me right up there. Oh, I, I wouldn't mind two coffees if, if it wouldn't be too much trouble. You got it. I has to go bathroom. Here's my restaurant. I'll get us a bite. Yeah. Yeah, look at that. Smells good. Looks good, too. Take a sniff. No, thank you. What'd you say your name was? Carrie. Carrie. Cash and carry. No cash and carry, huh? <laughs> Now, look, the first thing we got to learn you is where it's OK to eat. Because some cans got garbage and bad stuff. But this guy here runs a good, clean restaurant. All right, you go first. Take your pick. Come on. People pay good money for this stuff. We're just lucky that it hasn't gone home in some dumb doggy bag. Oh! Half a good roast beef sandwich with horseradish. Oh, boy. Oh, beautiful vegetables. You know, they got vitamins and minerals. This guy really knows how to buy. Look at this, a great piece of melon. Here, take it. It's good for you. Take it. Ah! And parsley. Oh, here. Uh -uh. Now, come on. You need some beef on your bones. No, I'll eat, I'll eat later. Oh. Well, in that case, you're going to have to take it with you. I think the shelter is the place for you. But let me tell you something. You better eat this stuff before you get there. Because once you get in the shelter, they take all your things away. And their food ain't so good. Tastes like slop gut. 
Here. Me, I like vegetables, raw vegetables. I'm crazy. I'm gonna let them take away my stuff, put me in a room of screaming memes, and wash me down with knit wash. It smells like kerosene. No, sirree. I'd rather freeze in the street. Me too. I'll stay with you. No way. I travel alone, kiddo. I go on up there and ask for help. I can't. They know me. I thought you said you was new to the city. And if you've been on the streets, how come you're so damn clean? I lived with a friend. Oh, and he threw you out, huh? <laughs> ah, well, happens that way sometimes. They take you and they give it a try. Then they get sick of you and they kick you the hell out. Where's Flora? What do I care? Maybe I got lucky she moved to another corner. The subway grates on your corner. It's nice and warm over there. You know how old she must be? Sometimes I think she's not gonna last another winter. So? Maybe she's dead. Now, you're dead, you selfish cheapskate. Oh, sure, you're such a good guy. You let her live in your house, eat from your plates, right? In a pig's eye, you would. She could go many places if she'd just take a bath, get the nits out of her hair. And I'll tell you, her time's running out. You gotta drink lots of water. Oh, yeah. Well, now, if you're gonna be persnickety, here. Plain old vinegar. Toughens up your feet so they take you where you want to go. Toughens up your innards, too. Oh, you got to learn to eat lots of raw vegetables. They're healthy and they're good for you. Here, you eat this here carrot. Good for your teeth, good for your eyes. Oh, oh, and here's something. Iodine? Yep, for iron. Two drops a day keeps the doctor away. Wonder what you're missing. You know, you two shouldn't stay here. Trucks pull in to load up. Fall asleep around here, they'll squash you like bugs. Besides, a girl got raped here one night. Nobody heard her, because nobody was around. See how he looked at you? All men think women on the streets as tramps. <laughs> you gotta know how to protect yourself. First of all, you gotta make them think you're crazy. <laughs> and you gotta kick them anywhere, everywhere. And you gotta bite them, scratch your eyes out. Remember, you're fighting for your life. Let them all think you're crazy. Then everybody will leave you alone, right? You see, kid, you're in a jungle. It's like a bad dream, but you don't wake up. Do they think you're crazy, Flora? What? Do they think you're crazy? I hope so. But I'm not crazy. I'm smart. I'm still here, and I know how to protect myself. Come on, we gotta go. And you gotta wrap up better. Here, put this on and hide that beautiful hair of yours. Come on, put your hair off underneath there. Whew. That a girl. 
hurts. Dr. S.C. Jones, please contact the information system on the lower level. Dr. M.C. Jones, please contact the information system on the lower level. Moving. Walter, your mother is waiting for you at window cell. This here terminal's not a bad place to stay. And I'll show you around and get you settled, but then I got to get back. You know, feet get wet, and you get big sores that don't heal up. Very important that you take care of your feet. Got to be real careful. How did you learn so much? I've been on the streets a long time. You had a home once, though? Everybody had a home once. What was it like? Well, it, it was a farm, uh, just a little place, but it was real nice. It had wicker furniture and, and curtains, and we grew vegetables, good ones. Not like that city junk you get around here. How did you lose it? You don't want to hear all that sad stuff. Yes, I, I do. Come on, let's get out of here. Somebody's crying. It's dangerous. The cops don't come here, but other people do. Wait, that, that's a baby. Might be abandoned. It's not our lookout. Come on back. We got no protection. People will kill for a quarter if they're hungry enough. Hello, can we help you? Foreigners. What do they want? Food, probably. Estuda, estuda, believe estuda. All right. Okay, all right, all right. Come on, come on. Who's on? It's okay. It's Grace. Now, you go straight in and don't let nobody talk to you. You hear? Well, what about you? No, no, no. Two is too many. You go first. Where's your car? I hid it. I, I got a special way. Oh. oh, it's so hard pushing that thing, especially in winter. You ought to use a locker like me. Uh-uh. Mm -mm. My stuff stays in my cart. <laughs> you find a place yet? Temporarily without. How are you feeling? Oh, so-so. Hurts here sometimes. If they just let us sleep once in a while. Oh, being out's going to kill you, Flora. Yeah. And people are so mean, too. Yeah. How do you manage at your age? I got a gift of gab, I guess. <laughs> you sure do. Mm. Hope you got a cigarette, too. No siree, Bob. Smoking gets your lungs. <laughs> Flora? Oh, yeah, yes, yes. Uh, just resting. That young one come in with you? Uh, yes, she's my daughter. She's from out of town. And she's got a bus ticket. Well, hurry up and then get out of here. Oh, oh, oh yes, ma'am. You can come back tonight if you got no place to sleep. Thanks a million. Well, you're all set now. You just stay here, 